Hi everyone and welcome back to Table Tennis Tuesdays. Today we're going to be focusing on shadow play. Shadow play is where you use no ball whatsoever and you just focus on the movement of the shots. It's a really, really good technique to practice muscle memory and how the shots would feel when you do get onto the table with a bat and ball. Today I'll be using a bat but you don't need any equipment whatsoever, you could just use your hand practice the motion. This is such a good technique if you have no equipment at home but you still want to practice the movements of the different shots. So today we're going to be going through some sequences of shadow play that you can practice at home looking at all different shots in table tennis. Hope you enjoy. shadow play and your footwork and reaction time so you need someone who can help you and you need either four different colours or four items that are different so they can call out the different objects so I've gone for coloured pieces of card you need two that would be close to the net and two that would be by the edge of the table okay these two closest to the net are pushes so this one here pink is a forehand push this one here yellow is a backhand push and then we've got the green which would be a forehand drive and the blue which would be a backhand drive okay you can change these make them top spins loops whatever you like okay so what this game is someone will call out a color and you would then have to respond with the shots that i've just said okay it's looking at quick footwork making sure with these pushes we're stepping in with the right foot so with the forehand we want to be stepping in with the right foot with the back hand we're in the left foot okay always making sure after every shot we're back to that ready position okay in the center of the table on the balls of our feet so if i call pink and then green okay i'm reacting to those shots so the person on the other side will call out a sequence okay and you need to react so what's great about this game is you can adapt it to any shots you want to focus on so my push is here closer than that i could change the flicks so instead of coming under the ball i'll come over the top so a forehand flick and a backhand flick and these ones here, instead of doing drives like I did, you could do top spins or you could do smashes, loops, it's up to you. 
mix it up so you can practice all the different shots. If you don't have someone who can call out the colours for you, you can always do it yourself, okay? So I'm going to do an example now. So remember, these two are pushes, these two I'm doing as drives, okay? So pink, green, blue, pink, pink, green, yellow, blue, green. I'm making sure after every shot we're returning to that central base, okay? Even after those pushes, we're coming in and springing back out. Thank you.